And we begin tonight with an update on the story I was covering live in November as a white powder was found at American Business Center in Boardman. New court documents just released are shedding new light on that investigation, and it turns out a local political candidate's name is in that paperwork. 27 First News reporter Nadine Grimley talked to investigators for tonight's top story. FBI agents have collected a DNA sample from Warren's auditor-elect Anthony Nadel. This is all part of their investigation into how Nadel's health insurance papers got into the same envelope as white powder sent to his former employer. An affidavit suggests he was upset over his firing. When the documents were returned in an envelope uh, with his health insurance information in it. Some white powder was also found in that letter, um, or in that envelope, rather. I tried reaching out to Nadal both at his home and by calling his cell phone for comment, but I haven't heard back. I hope it's not true. AJ's a, a nice guy. I've met him on quite a few times, obviously, in the last six months and that, but uh, we'll let the legal process handle that from now on. Now the FBI is waiting to see if the DNA they collected from Natal Monday morning matches that to a piece of mail sent to the American Business Center last November. It'll definitely take several weeks uh, and you know at that point the investigation is still ongoing so it isn't like when we get results back that we would issue anything at that point. So far Natal hasn't been charged with anything. In Boardman, Nadine Grimley, WKBN 27 First News. Nadine also reached out to the Trumbull County Board of Elections to see how this could impact the race for city auditor. Deputy Director Stephanie Penrose told her, quote, nothing has been presented to the board and therefore we have nothing to address at this point.